Jason Wilcox has informed Southampton about his desire. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Fabrizio Romano here, as always, to keep you posted on the transfer market. Today, guys, we touch on new key piece for Manchester United future era. Also, something important to say on Kepa and Joao Neves, two important names for the summer transfer window. Let's jump into it together. And so guys, let me start with Manchester United because an exclusive update I told you yesterday is about Jason Wilcox. I can guarantee to you once again that Jason Wilcox will be the new director of technical director of Manchester United. The agreement between Jason Wilcox and May United is in place. Jason Wilcox has informed Southampton about his desire to join May United. The structure will include Omar Berrada as new CEO, and then Dan Ashworth, who is going to join Manchester United. We will see when, because the conversation between Man United and Newcastle on compensation is still ongoing, so the timing is not clear yet, but Dan Ashworth wants to go to Manchester United. This is very clear. And then Jason Wilcox. The agreement is done between Wilcox and Man United. Now it's time to understand about the compensation fee, the timing uh, between Southampton and Man United to make it happen. But he's already resigned. He's informed Southampton of his desire to go to Manchester United. Reports about Liverpool are not true from what I heard. Jason Wilcox is not going to Liverpool, never started a concrete negotiation with Liverpool. Liverpool have different ideas and Jason Wilcox has only one focus, Manchester United. His former head of academy at Manchester City, he did an incredible job. Uh, job with people like Joe Shields and many others at Man City. Now, full focus on Manchester United future with Ineos. So, work in progress, but trust me, it's only May United and it's all agreed between Jason Wilcox and Manchester United. And this is going to bring many future talents to the club because what I told you already here on the channel and was the idea of the club is to create kind of galaxy of talents, including Nice and Lausanne in Switzerland, as crucial clubs to send talents to develop and then become May United level of players. So this is important for Manchester United. One of the players that May United are following remains Joao Neves from Benfica. I told you multiple times already in September, in October, in November, that May United scouts have been regularly in attendance to follow Joao Neves and they will keep following him. They were in attendance the last game of Benfica and they will return again in the final months of the season. Now, crucial games are coming and May United will follow Joao Neves closely, waiting for the decision on how much they want to invest on midfielder. He will be expensive. Release clause is now 120 million euros. Benfica will try to put a higher clause into his contract but in any case, he's going to be a very expensive player. Also, Joao Neves has been scouted by Manchester City too and Bayern. These two clubs have sent their scouts multiple times to follow him. So let's see what's going to happen there. And what's going to happen with Real Madrid goalkeepers is quite clear. Thibaut Courtois will return at the beginning of next season. Real Madrid are waiting for him. Andy Lunin is doing fantastic. Real Madrid are super happy with him. He's with George Mendes now as new agent. There is a negotiation ongoing over new contract between Lunin and Real Madrid. They want him to stay, waiting for the player green light. And then Kepa will return to Chelsea. Kepa will not stay at Real Madrid. No intention to keep the player. Also, Kepa wanted to play more. He's not super happy, obviously. He's super respectful of Real Madrid. It's still a dream for him to be at Real Madrid. But he wanted to play more. He was not expecting this kind of situation. And so Kepa is leaving at the end of the season, returning to Chelsea. And so guys, let me know your thoughts on all these stories, including Joao Neves, Jason Wilcox and Kepa. I wait for your opinion here in the comments. Remember to like this video, turn on the notification bell, subscribe to the channel. See you soon with Fabrizio. Ciao.